Happy uh, New Year's Eve, guys. Uh, I know it's kind of funny how I say guys, like there's a lot of guys watching this. Anyhow, um, this is the uh, Kyosho uh, Ultima I've been working on, restoring a little bit. Um, most of the work really has already been done. Uh, there was nothing really wrong with this car. Um, and let me see if the, maybe the lights are a little, I don't know. I don't have good lights in this, in this room, but anyways, uh, really not a whole lot left to do. Uh, I've upgraded the, um, I'm going to get it wrong again, I guess, to, uh, universals or CVDs, uh, replaced, uh, or put ball bearings throughout there's not a lot of ball bearings in this kit i'm gonna stay with the silver can original motor i don't know what that is an 05 something doesn't look like it's super fast anyways i think that's original um chassis not too scuffed up there's a little nick taken out of the front bumper here other than that there's not a lot of damage in the car i replaced the uh spring uh what did you call those spring clamps uh with some aluminum ones uh bought those on ebay um i've used these for a lot of kits and they're great um just perfect every time they you know they they kind of retain that original look in my opinion and they're you know indestructible basically although don't over tighten those because they will strip out it's just some little uh, maybe a cast aluminum or something I, I don't know but anyhow um i use those on almost every one of these old uh kyosho kits um way too much servo there i get it i had it it's new um i kind of adjusted the throw there because i got way too much torque here for that um, but that should that should be fine um, just gonna do some light running with this car uh, what else anything else um, yeah I replaced these um, the little uh, oh boy I've been drinking by the way cheers uh, New Year's almost um, 2020 can kiss my ass Anyway, so um, I'm rambling. I, I replaced those guys. Um, I guess you'd call those. Uh, oh God, I just said it in my last video. Anyways, those are those are plastic normally. Anyways, this was the original top plate that came with the car. Um, it's a shame because it's not really it's not really cracked anywhere, which I guess is kind of common for this plastic top plate. Um, the only thing I didn't really like about this one is that somebody got a little happy with the Dremel maybe or some pliers and kind of overdid it here with the, uh, I guess there was a throttle servo here originally. I won't run a throttle or a, a mechanical throttle so, or, you know what I'm saying. Um, so anyways, uh, um, I didn't want to live with that. But yeah, kind of a shame because otherwise I think it was still pretty solid uh so i got this guy off of ebay jg made a lot of aftermarket parts back in the day um we're gonna slap this guy on see what it looks like i don't know that i'm crazy about how this thing looks to be honest but uh yeah we'll, we'll have a look here um i can't remember what i gave for this probably more than the car um, anyways the other thing I got coming for this car are some aluminum uh, wheels uh, it's a kit or uh, I'm sorry some pieces from a guy in Hong Kong I guess um, and I, I should have written down the name because the guy makes I think he's the same guy that makes these uh, Aluminum uh, shock collars. Shock collars, that's the right name. Whoa. Uh, shouldn't I have... Okay, four of those. Those are the big boys. 
Got these stickers here. Keep that for a body. This car needs a body. It has a body, but it's in bad shape. This is scotch. Mm. Mm -hmm. Pretty good. Uh, let's see here. All right. This, I don't know where this little uh, screwdriver kit came from. Kmart or something. But it usually works out. Okay, so I think once I, if I put this top plate on, this guy would be kind of trapped in there. And I don't know if that's what we want. So maybe I'll leave that out for now. Because, yeah, your battery will slide through there. Hope you can see. Um, yeah, does that feel any more sturdy than the original? Mm, not really. Mm, I hope this fits. That'd be embarrassing if it didn't. Hello. Okay. I'm going to start with these big boys first. Um, I just want to recommend that you don't work on your car after you've had three or four glasses of scotch. Um, that's when I do most of my working on cars, but most of my cars don't work right. Damn, those are gonna, that's gonna take some fortitude to get those guys in. Um, you might be asking, why is this dude like playing with RC cars on New Year's Eve? Shouldn't he be partying or something? tonight but then i would ask you like why are you watching rc car videos in the first place right you, you obviously don't have much of a social life either so don't hate on me oh man holy sh crap wow. that is really tight I don't see why that would be be necessary. <laughs> okay, I'm sweating. And oh, holy shit. That screw's never coming out. Okay. If I knew how to do, if I knew how to work my camera or edit videos, I would fast forward through the rest, the rest of these. But I don't. Okay, my arm's tired. So why don't we just leave those like that for now. We'll try some of these other guys. Okay, man, if you watch me putting all these screws in, whew, I'm sorry. It's looking good. I like the way this looks, I gotta say. Okay. But you can see, I guess this kind of assumes that you're not gonna run a mechanical speed control because it doesn't give you a place for another servo, right? They know what time it is. Oh, shit. Let me try a different one. Um, so, anyhow, I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna torture you guys with watching me put the rest of these uh, screws on because it, I could be here for 30 minutes. But anyways, <laughs> I think that looks pretty solid, man. Um, I'll make another video when I get the uh, wheels and tires. I got a, a, a set of brand new tires from a Kyosho Rampage kit. It's got the little front knobbies. Um, hold on a second. It's got the little front knobbies, kind of like this uh, Ultima Pro. No, eh, wrong. It's got the rear knobbies, you know, that we're all used to. Um, yeah, I don't have the tires. But anyways, I'll make another video. 
soon as those get here in a couple of weeks and uh we'll take a look at it then definitely gonna run this guy um gonna maybe go with like an a turbo Ultima body instead of the original cage and a little uh, little man I don't know I'm just not really a fan of this thing um, I don't know that it would even work here I guess it would there's no place to there's no body mount holes here and and yeah I don't know we'll see but anyways, thanks for watching. Hope you guys are having a good New Year's Eve. Um, be safe if you're traveling tonight. Um, and uh, I'll see you next time. Thank you.